What the heck is up, y'all? This is Rocky Top Off-Road back here today. So, this is a new series that I started. And, um, I got, it's, uh, so like it's a t starting a towing company from scratch is what it is. So, we got our old 66 Chevy here with a 454 big block. Got the blower on it, everything. So, this is our house right here where we work on everything, where everything stays. And we're going to try to turn this little towing company into a big towing company, like a multi-million dollar company. So, let's see if we can do it. So, I got my first call this morning. We're heading off back here to a creek that uh, somebody actually um, took their uh, old truck back there and wound up breaking some axles and they ran out of gas and stuff like that. I don't know. It it didn't make much sense how they did it, but I ain't going to talk bad or nothing about them. Seem like seem like good folks. But anyway, uh, we're going to go down this way, down this road here. And, uh, well, I don't know which exactly creek it was at, so I'm going to pull off here and check. But, okay, yeah, it's, a. Uh, should be this one that's straight, yeah. All right, it's right, right down the road. So, let's see. Yeah, he said it was right by the river jump. He used to hit that thing on dirt bikes all the time in three-wheelers. That was fun. Dang, that's a good-looking truck. Oh, yep, there it is. He said it was old pink square body. 6-2 diesel. He, uh, I think he broke all four axles and ran out of diesel, so we're going to have to clean the injectors out and uh, put all new axles on it. I think he's wanting Dana 80s on it now because he's going to go ahead and fix it up is what he told me. But uh, So now I just got to figure out how to get this old girl out of here. Uh, let's see. I guess let me climb back up here, and I may bring the truck down in there, because my cable ain't long enough to reach that. So, let's take the old C30 here. Get her fired up. Gonna just have to put her all creep off this hill. Oh, there we go. There we go. Alright, so now I need to figure out... I gotta get turned around here. I know this ain't gonna hurt my truck, but I might have to do a little work on this trailer, get it all set up. I don't know. We'll figure something out. Uh, yeah. All right. So I got it pretty much lined up. I'm gonna load her up, and I'll see y'all. All right, y'all. So I accidentally cut the camera off too quick, but so we got her all loaded up, and I'm gonna go ahead and uh, throw her in gear and it's got this hydraulic dry pitch so i'm gonna raise that up so maybe that'll give us a little extra clearance and uh, we're gonna try to kind of go up this creek a little bit it ain't too deep or nothing i'm gonna grab the old trusty map and look at it real quick it looks like it gets a little shallower up here and we might get uh, gun it get out of here How are we gonna get up this ledge? Might have to get a little speed or something for that. Uh, let me think for a sec. Back up. It's hard pulling a trailer over rocks and all. I think if I go this way, I got it. Cap. No, it ain't straight enough. We're good. We're good. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Let's go. All right, y'all. So we got her on up. And that's he's on out of here. Alright, now here's gonna be the tricky part. How the heck are we gonna get out of here? I got kinda lucky. That's my buddy that owns that field right there. And uh, he don't use it no more. So, I'm just gonna kinda gun it and nail it out of there. And we'll try to find the exit to this field. Jump out of here. I'm gonna hook this winch up here somewhere. 
I might, that fence post may work. All right, y'all, so I wound up having to change it around and I put an anchor in the ground. And that helped us pull it right on out of there. So let me unhook that real quick. All right, y'all, so we got her all unhooked and put back up. So that's a throw down in love and he's on out of here. We can throw her in high now. Uh, I don't know exactly how to get out of this. Uh, we'll see her in a second. It ain't down here, I don't. No. No, it ain't down there. There it is, right up here. Gotta kind of swing out here wide and he's on back down here. While we're pulling out here, y'all, I just want to thank y'all so much for all my old subscribers, my new subscribers, everybody, y'all. I just want to thank y'all so freaking much for that. That means a lot, and uh, we're so close to 500 subscribers. Um, I will be working on a 500 subscriber special when we hit it, so I just want to thank y'all for that, and let's get back to the video. Alright y'all, so we're eating back on out here, about to get back to the house up here, and uh, yeah, so that was our first retailing job, and we've got a couple more coming tomorrow, so I am going to have to run over to, to uh, Lowe's and all, because somebody came through, I don't think it was nobody around here, but I guess they were just coming through tearing stuff up stole all my tools that I had sitting on the back of the truck. So I'm gonna have to go go get some of them. Might have to use my personal account for that, but I don't know, we'll figure it out. But there's the old house right there. Let me get her backed up in here. I already asked my neighbors, they said they didn't care if I parked the trailer right close to it, you know. And uh Yeah, so I think I'm on Parker there. So, yeah, so that was our first tone job. If y'all like this series, please hit that like button, subscribe, share it with your friends, whatever. And I hope to keep doing this series because it's fun to make. So, yeah, maybe, maybe next episode we'll have some more older cars, trucks, new ones. It don't matter. We'll see. But... I just want to thank y'all so much for watching this. Thanks again for my new subscribers, old subscribers, everybody. Thanks for the support on this channel. Thank y'all for everything. And I hope y'all have a great day. Bye for now.